These students were frustrated. They were intimidated by police officers. They were kicked. If you look at me right here, this is the clothing I had yesterday to today. I was beaten by the OCS Tandel. Wanafunzi walipigwa pale polisi walikuwa wanawakanyaga kama mabusu ni kama kuna mtu alilipa mapolisi waweze kupiga wanafunzi huko baada ya kupigwa hakuna chakula wanapewa wanafunzi walilala njaa asubuhi wanaletewa maji na mkate moja slice moja wa kunye alafu wanafunzi wanashika wanapelekwa comrades i also have some of my colleagues whom we were arrested with let me allow them at least to say what. Comrades Bow. Comrades Viva. Viva. More money to Comrades, more money. More food to Comrades, more food. More sex to Comrades, more sex. Comrades Viva. Viva. I as a nation, I say I condemn in the strongest part terms possible that no Comrades will be in the police cell. Comrades will be in the classrooms. Comrades will be in their hostels. Comrades will be in their, 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 their rooms. Comrades will be enjoying. Comrades will be eating. Comrades will not be the police cells. Comrades will not be the court. We say all the comrades will be released unconditionally. Comrades power. Comrades viva. I as a Deneshashe, I strongly condemn any police officer who is harassing comrades, any management in the Kenya Poly, who is harassing comrades, we will come there and take you there physically. We will hold you with your teeth and mandibles. We will hold you accountable. We will never join. Uh, we managed to secure seven. Two of them have been taken to Kodiaga and they've been charged on different accounts, uh, the four accounts. The first account is uh, creating disturbance, the second account is creating disturbance, the third account is uh, uh, malicious damage, and the fourth account is malicious. So uh, the two have been charged on four accounts and they've uh, given a cash bill of 20,000 each. So that is the position. Out of, uh, the, uh, out of the rest that are remaining in custody, we have 19 of them whom have been taken to Kondele. Uh, my surprise is this. Uh, all these students, the way they were arrested yesterday, some of them were arrested while in a meeting to organize on how they want to start their serious campaigns. As we all know, Kisumu Poli is currently in a serious campaign to usher in new leadership. Therefore, uh, some of the students were in some hotel organizing on how they want to start their serious campaigns. Through that, they were arrested in that hotel and taken to Kondele Police Station. I went to Kondele Police Station to, to see to it that uh, they get released, and I was told there that they will be arraigned, in, all of them will be arraigned in court today, and their charges, uh, their charge sheets are ready. 
Uh, upon reaching the courts, uh, we only get shocked and surprised that about seven of them, uh, nine of them were arraigned in court and about 19 have just been taken to Kondele and their files are not ready. So allow me to say this very strongly. First, let me condemn the brutal and harassment on the side of the police. All of them were beaten thoroughly. And as you can see, uh, some of them have just demonstrated. They've just opened up their bodies and have they, they've shown you how they were beaten and roughed up. Some of them doesn't have their phones. Their phones are still remaining in some other quarters. So I want to ask the police from Kisumu County, please treat the comrades with a language and uh, with a, 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 in a decorum way that you will also you that you'd also want to treat your, your children to be treated whatever you are doing to them you are doing you are dealing with them as if they are bandits and on that account i want to condemn that and such kind of acts in the strongest terms possible and as a leader within kisumu county we want to tell you that you have done it once and we don't expect you to do it twice and we don't expect you to do it thrice let it end from there Kindly, whenever there is a problem, always use local, uh, local, uh, 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 local mechanism, a way on how you can handle these affairs, these issues, without even taking anybody to police, without even beating anybody or roughing them up. Two, the student leaders have been, the, the Kisumu police students have been demonstrating. Let me say this. It is not wrong to demonstrate. Because the Article 37 of the Kenyan Constitution talks about demonstration. They have been talking, they have been expressing their rights in the public. There are quite a number of issues that the Kisumu police students have been talking about. I want to ask all the leadership of Kisumu County, led by the Governor, Professor Peter Nyangnyong, yes. the Senator Tom Onyanda, yeah. all members of Parliament from Kisumu County, and all members of County Assembly, Make sure that you come forward and intervene on these matters that are affecting the students of Kisumu Poli with immediate effect. Yeah. Yeah. These students from Kisumu Poli, they are not mad. These students from Kisumu Poli, huh? they are not mad. Whenever they talk, there is an issue. Make sure that those issues that affect them are sorted out with immediate effect. Yeah. Yeah. To the administration, the local administration, we have had a lot of issues touching on your leadership. We want to tell you, as leaders from Kisumu County, we really value Kisumu Poli as a school that is producing very intelligent personalities in Kenya. Okay. And we want, to, we want you to make sure that you nurture our students. We want to see you mentor our students. We don't want you to see you harass, harass and intimidate our students through, with, 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 uh, through, police of, uh, through, through police. We don't want to see you interfering with their social status or their social way of education simply because you think you have a lot of money that you can use to, inter to interfere with their learning uh, attention. Lastly, let me say this. For those that have been arrested and uh, some of them have been taken to Kodiaga, for the two that are in Kodiaga and the 19 that are in police custody, I want to ask the student Please, students, don't make any noise. We are going to follow up and see to it that all the ones that are in custody to be released with immediate effect so that you can proceed on with your normal lives. Uh, uh? And the ones that have been assaulted, we want to tell them that we are with you. And as human rights activists, we are going to see to it that you are taken to, the, to different health care so that uh, you get serious medical attention after which you will follow the legal redress if it is a matter of uh, proceeding on with the matter through the police we make sure that those that eat you those that beat you those that uh, beat you are put into uh, are put uh, are put to answer to what they did to you people lastly the ones uh, the ones that are lacking their phones also you we are going to follow up so that you get your phones if at all there is somebody who is holding them uh, to finish let me tell all the leaders from Kisumu County, it cannot be right that each and every time our students from Kisumu Poli are demonstrating and people are just quiet about it. They have demonstrated about thrice, but no single leader has spoken about it. It is time, it is time that we address it. It is time that we come forward 
and talk about this serious matter of demonstration and we see why the students are demonstrating. Because one, if it is about food, let the food program be arranged in a proper way so that the student can get something to put into their stomach. If it is about fee and decapitation, we are telling William Samoy Ruto, you are not our president. We don't recognize you as our president. And whatever you are doing to the comrades, we are telling you very soon, we shall organize ourselves, we shall parade ourselves in the streets of Kisumu to demonstrate and speak very loudly and tell you, enough is a enough. And lastly, on the issue of the finance bill, on the issue of the finance bill, I want to tell you that the students leaders from Kisumu, all, the, all of the student leaders and all the comrades from Kisumu County are saying no to the finance bill. How many are saying no to the finance bill? No! No to the finance bill! No! Comrades, power! Power! Comrades, power! Power! Comrades, rear! Rear!